What's up guys, my name is Aaron. This is my wife, Christine. We're full-time RVers and today we are gonna do a very quick walkthrough of the 2021 Airstream Interstate GT Interior. Let's go. <laughs> Right off the bat, you can see the new Mercedes chassis here behind us and these super cush Airstream seats. These are so nice. We're in a 2014 Airstream Interstate and these new body styles we absolutely love. So let's take a closer look at the dash here and we'll just show you a quick view of what it is. So here's these seats. You can kind of see they got that nice emblem by Airstream and they're very contoured. How comfortable are they? I love these seats and I even really, really enjoy the dark brown color. It's very rich. It's a very rich, good looking color. It's classy. Yep. Up top here, there's a CD player for the coach side, it looks like. And then you have the great Mercedes uh, infotainment center. Um, I can't quite see the steering wheel there, but there it is. That's that super luxury, <laughs> nice Mercedes feel. And uh, this interior is just great also has the automatic sliding door on this thing which with the touch of a button if you haven't seen this all i got to say is wow and that's really nice because those doors are heavy yeah they're we, heavy duty we slam those things every day when we get into an argument when <laughs> when i open ours i have to pop my hip into it just to like help push it out and get it open yep here is the sliding screen door, which is right off the kitchen galley. That airflow feels really good. Oh, we, that's nice. We've been in here for just a minute and uh, it's starting to heat up, but uh, that's a beautiful exterior shot. And just you can just feel this flow come in. I love it. You wanna hit that button and we'll close that up so we can uh, hear one? ourselves. Yep, we got some traffic going on outside. That is so slick. Yeah, just like that, the door closes up. Love Chris, it. why don't we pop into the kitchen here, take a look at this brand new faucet and built-in sink, which looks great. I love, a residential faucet always makes it feel amazing. And having this um, countertop cutting board is great so that you can use it as a countertop. I know when I come in with groceries, this is a landing pad for groceries. So to be able to use this, use that, use the whole thing, it makes a big difference. The sink is beautiful. I love that. Beautiful. That's, that's a nice upgrade from the 2020 version, which we toured last year. And there's not a ton of major differences, but this is one of the major differences that sticks out to both of us. Why don't you pop open that cabinetry and we can see all of that beautiful space. All the way down? Sure. <laughs> Lots of cabinetry. This is a huge running board of cabinetry and all of these drawers are massive. These are massive drawers. Like you can contain so much kitchen equipment in here. It's unbelievable. And we have this nice microwave oven, which pulls out. It's nice to have the drawer style so that you don't have to squat down to open up and reach in. Rather, you can stand comfortably and look over. And I really like that. The kitchen's amazing. Plus you get this view. And when you're standing right here, and the windows are all open, you get that classic Airstream window coverage feeling where you really get a true like 180, even more than 180 degrees of vision. Love the cabinets, love the kitchen. I love this extra counter space because I don't have this counter space in ours and this makes a big, big difference for when you're prepping and cooking. Speaking of cooking, let's look at that giant fridge over there. Okay. So this is a Nova Cool. And it's a really decent sized fridge. I like how it's um, eye level too and not a uh, uh, like a kneel down like yeah. ours is on the floor. Yeah, because you know, those dorm size fridge, when they're on the floor, every time you're squatting and juggling to touch those things in, that can get hard on your knees. Um, lots of door space on this. 
the freezer is a good size freezer and this pulls out as well which same as the microwave especially when you're in a limited little galley like this makes it super convenient you can stack a ton this this freezer is huge looks like a lot of ice cream space in there <laughs> ice cream if that's your jam yeah but what i really like about the kitchen cabinetry is this amazing pantry right here because it's already like custom organized ready to go you can change things on this top so if you want to take these nice shelves out and use it as a dedicated hanging wardrobe you can do that but having these pull out drawers on sliders is really great and just having this already prefabricated makes it so much easier to get into and get organized right away i love it Let's take a quick peek into this wet bath. It is kind of your typical wet bath. They are small, they are tight, but it is so good to have a bathroom and shower on a van. We absolutely love ours and it comes in so handy. Looks like they upgraded the uh, soap dispenser there a little bit on the wall, make it a little bit more modernized. This faucet is an upgraded design from ours. Looks pretty good. Pull out mirror, shower head goes up to the top and also uh, is your sink faucet and you got your flush toilet along with this cool little motion sensor on the wall to give you a little extra light at night motion sensor would be really really nice to have absolutely on to the back lounge so this is the back lounge space in here and this is a power sofa along with power ottomans and so this whole area here comes and makes a giant bed, which is pretty cool. It is a big, it's a huge bed. Yeah, it's a really nice space. The uh, walls are bumped back a couple inches from the 2019 interstate. So it gives you that really big extra kind of couple inches of feeling. And it looks like that's the mount for the lagoon table back there. So you can have seating for five. And what else do we got back here? TV couple USB ports on the cabinetry there and if we sneak back here this is the extra 18 inches of space and kind of dark back here lights we don't have power in here but you can kind of see some built-ins on the side and then a lot of extra storage space back here in the trunk which is pretty cool we have the 22 foot interstate so we don't have that extra 18 inches and uh that's some good storage. Yeah, you can fit a lot back there. Up top, this is a great cabinet up here. It is huge. This is deeper than ours too because of the Yeah, it goes, it goes all the way back. So it's a, it's a giant cabinet and we like to store our winter clothes kind of in the back corners. And then all of our bedding and pillows and things like that store up top. All of these windows have power shades that come down with the touch of a button. So when you hit that, everything turns into night mode. You got blackouts and you're ready to watch the movie or go to bed. <laughs> These new floor plan interstates are awesome. We are extremely jealous. We know there's a few of you out there that watch our channel that have this on order and awesome. You are gonna absolutely love it. Definitely worth the wait. Absolutely. So that is about it this is a very quick walkthrough we hope you liked it it's the 2021 airstream interstate gt and we'll see you on the next video bye